Let's take a look at the newest version of 3D Flow Masquerade. We've changed the user interface to simplify the masking operation as much as possible. Just keep in mind the red and blue brushes. With the red brush, trace a rough stroke on the object you want to reconstruct. With the blue one, do the same for the unwanted background. Once you've finished, the area of interest is as highlighted in red. We've developed other tools for finishing the masked area, like the lasso and the polygonal selection. When you're satisfied of the result, save and work on the next photo. Stay tuned for more tutorials on 3D Flow Zephyr.